Good day. We are BSN 3F, Group 3A. I am Diana Tibuok, and together with me are Palma May Marquez, Ashley Trisha Miranda, Franzi Eliana Mugar, and Sofia Esmeralda Osser. We are here to present our research entitled Coping Orientation of Level 3 Nursing Students in Online Learning. Purpose of the Study The unexpected shift from face-to-face to -to online learning due to COVID-19 has increased students' concern regarding academic advancement and its harm to their academic performance. Various psychological orientations may help manage the stress caused by pandemic. The study aims to determine the coping orientations of level 3 nursing students and online learning. It helps in the awareness of necessary changes that must be done to overcome the challenges of online learning in nursing field. Thus, within the realm of surveys, We hope to discover and go in-depth with the study on how the third-year nursing students would be able to adapt a proper coping orientation that is suitable for them in dealing with stress of all the workloads and challenges during the online learning. Methodology Research Design Quantitative descriptive research design was utilized. It examined the level 3 nursing students' coping orientation in online learning by describing the nature of a demographic segment. Participants of the study, the 163 level 3 nursing student taken out from the total population of 274 third year nursing student using solvent formula. Researcher used the stratified random sampling technique, which involves the process in dividing the population into subgroups or strata before sampling is done, which enables equal chances for everyone to be selected in sample. Research instrument. The researchers utilized the standardized questionnaire adopted from BriefCope inventory by the value of Novo Psych data new norms for the BriefCope. The BriefCope is a 28-item self-report questionnaire that assesses effective and inefficient coping orientation in the face of a stressful life event. Coping is a broad term that refers to any attempt made to alleviate distress caused by unfavorable life situations. For the results and discussion of the study, first is the demographic profile of the participants. Most of the participants were 21 years old as reflected and the majority were female. Roman Catholic is the religion of most third-year nursing students and in terms of internet connectivity, most of them belong to category 2B. Coping orientation in terms of problem focus, sex, age, religion, and internet connectivity have a moderate mean and standard deviation. The level of coping orientation in terms of emotion focus, sex, age, religion, and internet connectivity have a moderate mean and standard deviation. In terms of avoidant focus, sex, age, religion, and internet connectivity have low mean as well as standard deviation. Significant relationship in the coping orientation of level 3 nursing students. There is significant relationship in the coping orientation of level 3 nursing students between the problem focus and emotion coping, as well as the emotion focus and avoidant coping. However, there is no significant relationship between the problem focus and avoidant coping. Significant difference in the coping orientation of level 3 nursing students. There is no significant difference in all type in all type coping style when they are grouped according to sex, age, religion, and internet connectivity. The difference in the mean is significant when P is less than 0.05. Results show that most level 3 nursing students are using problem-focused and emotion-focused coping orientation. The use of problem-focused coping orientation can change the stressful situation by using informational support actively coping, as well as planning and positive reframing. Recommendations. The study suggests that the educational institution involved one-day academic break to focus on self-care is needed to improve and strengthen the mental, emotional, and physical health of level 3 nursing students. Empowering level 3 nursing students to take care of themselves may lower their stressors and enhance their motivation to excel academically in online learning and even become productive members of their families and communities. Utilization. The result of the study will be submitted to provide the awareness to the institution, teacher, parents, and student about the level of stress among nursing students. Handed over the College of Nursing at USLS Baholod for them to address the stress of nursing students 
during the virtual learning and so the nursing student will be more able to manage their stress effectively. This is our presentation. Thank you for listening.